Are the numbers going? Yes, they are. All right. Hey, this is Chaplain Chat. This is great. I am at the big headquarters of Sisterhood of Grace. Come on in. Let's see what Sisterhood of Grace is about. Come on in. Oh, my gosh. I'm walking it. Whoa, okay. look who's right, greeting us at the door. <laughs> Ruth Han, the head honcho of Sister Oda Grace. Hi, Chaplain John. How are you doing? I am doing good. Awesome. And I'm so glad for you to stop by. And I'm in your place now. So you're in my place. And yeah. by the way, we're, you come to my place once a week, don't you? Twice a week. We're twi oh, I'm sorry. Yes. Where is? Where do you go twice I a week? Come in, uh, I come in Bob Wiley Detention Facility. For the women? The women's side only. Yes. Only the women. And, and then, I go into Unit 11, Unit 13, and pre-trial. Wow. And, and okay, we're going to check out Sisterhood of Grace because we want to find out what the heck a Sisterhood of Grace is all about. Yes. But this is your Come headquarters. In, yes. Come on in. Come on in. Give us a tour. We're getting a tour of Sisterhood of Grace. Well, this, here's our foyer. The foyer. The, the back door is the front door. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is how we come in. And uh, this is our entrance. People who come in their bicycles, they walk, they come on the buses, they come in cars, they come in whatever they want to do to get here. Isn't and this... then uh, they can park Oh my gosh. Here. Hey, real quick, we yes. talk about Sisterhood of Grace yes. in about a couple of minutes. Well, what is Sisterhood of Grace? Sisterhood of Grace is um, a place where it's a safe place. A safe place. For women, period. And, and a guy can come in right now, can I? Only only because um, you're safe. All right. <laughs> Already been. Yes. And, uh, no, no, keep going. I don't, right, so, I'm not answering this. I'm talking to you. Okay. And uh, anyways, <laughs> we provide a safe place for women in trauma or crisis. Oh, wow. Um, yes. And we provide healing and support. And uh, we do crisis intervention. And then we provide a safe place for community for women to come and walk out um, trauma and crisis in their lives and, and build community within, within. And you do Bible studies. So, yes. We're so going to see a bunch of ladies so anyway. Come to our on. safe place. Safe place. Yes. Safe place. Come on in. Woo! All right. And, all right, what are we so looking at now? We got a little kitchen going on in little, here. Little kitchen. Here's the kitchen. Yeah. Where oh they yeah. Get, they get their coffee. Look at that. They coffee. Get their, yeah. We got oh. a refrigerator for snacks and food and whatever we're doing here. Oh, okay. this is really a cool little house. I've never been here before. Right. Okay, keep coming. Right. Oh, what? Oh my gosh! What the heck? Come what on is in. This? Come on in. This is under that is the, the princess chair of the Most High yes. God. So it'll be a prince chair today. This is actually a chair that was donated that we're getting ready to refurbish. Oh, wow. Uh, this is our clothing closet. And what we have here is clothing that is being donated, and we have it for these women to come out of oh, wow. situations or out of jail, and they need to start all over, or they're getting ready to go do a job in the or they're going to school. So we were just providing with the clothing that was not really fit me here. No, just, just for women. Okay, yeah, yeah. All right, just for women. Okay. Just for women. Oh, okay. I, there's some noise going on back there. Yeah. I always oh, oh, well. Okay, now, oh, my gosh. Because, ladies, uh, you're all on Chaplain Chat now. Yeah. Yeah. Some of you ladies actually knew me someplace else, didn't yes. you? Yes. Yes. Oh my gosh, yes. look at that. And I'd much rather see them here than yes. there. Yes. Wow. Yes. What a connection yes. Sisterhood of Grace has with jail ministry. I mean, yes. I kid, is, uh, isn't this awesome? Yes. yes. How many of you actually got to meet Ruth Ann in the uh, jail? Woo! Isn't this great? Oh my God, this is fantastic. Bless well, come you. in. Oh, they got a piano back here. Yes. Has anybody ever played the piano? Is it we've just had, like... We've had members that do have played the piano. Well, yeah. sometime we'll have to talk to my wife yes. and be all to come yeah. in and play for you. Right. Too. And so, anyway, so this right. this, this is the waiting room. The waiting room. Yes. And this is where we come. Um, every we have classes here every day. Okay. Every day, Monday through Friday, from ten to twelve, and we have drawing classes. Um, from either 3, 5, to 6, to 8 every night. Okay, oh, you're, you're, you're talking to them. Right. You're talking to me, okay, but talking they heard that. Anyways, That's good. So um, women can come here, and so they have to come during the day. They come during the day. If they can't come in the daytime, they can come in the evening. Wow. And we have different classes going on every week. Oh, you get a hug? We, we used to work together there at the gym. Yes. Oh. So, uh, anyways, okay. we average about, as you can see, it's getting out. We're getting ready to start groups. So oh, yeah. Anyways, we've been, and it's, uh, anyways, but we average 18 to 20 women every day. And they come from all, all areas, from the community. And, uh, and it's just Live, laugh, love, inspire, create. I just thought right there. Oh. They're all blooming where they're planning. And we 
they come here and learn life skills. They learn to know God better, and they learn to be still. And they learn to uh, they, they learn to just bloom where they're planted. And uh, and while they're waiting for God to open the next doors for them, their life, they get to come here and just be, uh, just be instead of do. Okay, let's see what else we got over here. Keep coming here. No, I want to end in your office. That, this is not your office. Okay. Okay, but this is. Oh wow! Yes, uh, this is our resource room. Uh, Are you kidding? Maybe still under construction, uh, but anyway, so this is where people, women can come in and they can uh, they can get plugged in online, whether it be a school oh. or with uh, they can get online with school or with um, job resume. Oh, have, I was just going to say that coming in, helping them do helping resumes, them do resumes and so forth. Yeah. And then, uh, this is a resource library. It's growing and uh, an opportunity for them to oh my to get what they need here. Oh uh, my goodness. And then. Uh, we're getting ready to have an event tomorrow, so oh. so there's a lot going Which is, on. Okay, let's talk in your office, because right, well, that was go. the other reason we wanted to do a chaplain chat. Yes. And, uh, oh, bathroom, that's always yes, a good thing. Yes, there's our restroom. And, uh, and let me, uh, I'm going to sit Rachel, down here. Oh, Tracy, and this is Ruth Ann's office. Yes, well, my office and then Rachel, she shares with me. Uh, awesome. oh, yeah. Tomorrow, I mean, to Saturday. Yeah, it's tomorrow. What is happening tomorrow? Now I'm going to get this posted and I hope people watch it. But what is happening tomorrow? So tomorrow we are having a, our, a Giving Grace. Giving Grace. Um, and it's, it's a fashion show. And, um, and then along with that comes a silent auction. Wow. And a live auction. And, and what we're doing is, is the women here are going to be making their being fashion. Um, oh, get out. And, and they're going to auction. And in their, really? being, in their being fashion from the inside out. And we have, uh, we, have we, we have Curry Closet. We have the beauty salon behind us. We have women in the community who are coming alongside these women and doing their hair, providing them with clothing, things like that to, to be able to come to this event and be dressed up. And so they're being fashion like Esther on the inside and out. And then they get to, they, they are coming to this, this event. I'm, I'm just just kind of their servant leader. Yeah. And, uh, and well, you're going to be on. you're going to be pretty busy today. So, just getting, yeah, well, yeah. We're, this now, where is it at? It's not here. Okay, no, it's going to be at the road. Oh, the road. Yeah, 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 yeah. Street here by Saya. Where again? By the way, I'm going over there next. So John and I, we're going to talk about Iron. Okay. Well, so that's right. Grace, Iron. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes. Wow. Amen. And so, anyway, so yeah, we we got we got a lot of stuff already uh, uh, hiding out. Stuff that's being donated for the items the auction, and then we got some stuff here. And so this afternoon we'll be going over there. Actually, we're um, setting up. We're, 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 we're gonna tomorrow. We're gonna do this. We'll we're gonna get you back again on chaplain chat. But I this is awesome. Really, I think if people want to connect with Sister Sister of Grace, I think the best thing is have a call. Call me or they can like me on Facebook. Like you on Facebook. And if they want to call you, the number would be um, either 471, 471 917 or, or they can call the office here, and that's at 635 1516. And when I put this, I'll put it on there anyway. Ruth Ann, hi, hi. Hey, you know, I, I kid you not, we've known each other for a few years, and you're coming in, you're like a Brotherhood or sisterhood of grace is like a grace to a brotherhood or whatever, I don't know. But God bless you. And I gotta tell you, we're gonna be um, posting this and here's the wrap up of Chaplain Chat. Alright. This is really fun. I'm gonna say that if we blow it, we gotta do it all over again. From the door. We're not gonna blow it. It's I'm perfect. Say, I wanna thank you guys for watching. And I'm gonna say I wanna thank you for being on in a minute and say Chaplain Chat, but not yet. Just big sign off. I wanna thank you guys for watching. And I really want to uh, encourage you to give her a call. But Ruth Ann, I want to thank you for being on. Chaplain. Chaplain. Yeah! <laughs>